ever tried to help somebody and you had the best intentions and you were wanting to show loyalty and you were really wanting to help somebody and everything you did was misunderstood? Yeah, we've all been there. And so was King David one day. In 2 Samuel chapter 10, beginning with verse 1, Sometime after this, King Nahash of the Ammonites died, and his son Hunan became king. And David said, I'm going to show loyalty to Hunan just as his father. See, now, one of the principles the Bible teaches us is that our loyalty should go to the second generation. If a father was good to us, we are good to the son. The loyalty must always go to the next generation. I'm going to show loyalty to Hunan just as his father, Nahash, was always loyal to me. So David sent ambassadors to express sympathy to Hunun about his father's death. But when David's ambassadors arrived in the land of Ammon, the Ammonite commander said to Hunun, their master, Do you really think these men are coming here to honor your father? No. David has sent them to spy out the city so that they can come in and conquer it. So Hunun seized David's commanders, shaved off half of each man's beard, cut off their robes at the buttocks, and sent them back to David in shame. Now, brothers and sisters, isn't it interesting? David had 100%, not 99, 100% good intentions. But because Hunan listened to the wrong people, he misinterpreted everything David was trying to do. David wanted to show loyalty to the second generation, but the young king listened to the wrong voices in his life. Now, brothers and sisters, I wonder how many times in your life and my life someone has come to us to be a blessing and their heart was 100% good. I can think of the mistakes I've made in this. And then somebody who was close to us said, you know, I don't trust that person. You know what? I don't think that they have the best intentions. And you and I made a huge mistake. Can I ask you to just simply begin to understand that victory requires many counselors, not just a few people right around us. And anytime you're moving into something new and there are people around you, the warmongers, these were the commanders of the military, anytime people who have vested interests begin to try to turn you against something that Somebody says they're doing for good. Learn to take a couple of steps back and take a hard look at it. Be careful who you listen to. You could be starting problems when really it should have been the start of blessings. Blessings.